Well, finding a home at the price you want just got a lot more difficult here in the Valley. Thank you for staying with us tonight for 13 Action News live at 630. I'm Trisha Keen and I'm Ty Quinones. Well, home builders and developers, they are struggling to get supplies on time. 13 Action News reporter Abel Garcia shares how this supply chain crisis is impacting the cost of real estate right here in the Valley. A custom home builder here in Las Vegas tells me they ordered Italian cabinets for this home about four months ago. Last time he spoke to his suppliers, they told him they're still stuck at the ports. He says this supply chain crisis has taken a major toll on the production of his homes. We, we've never experienced um, the pandemic situation. Suppliers not delivering orders when promised, a low amount of inventory, and the high demand for homes. Just a few of the challenges operating partner of Lawrence Homes, Tamir Saham, says he is facing. Anywhere from six to eight to 10 week lead times are now in the 16 to 24 plus lead times. Saham has been in the home building business for more than 25 years. He has never witnessed this crisis before. Costs for some supplies going up by more than 200% increasing the average cost of their homes by more than 20 percent. Uncertainty of shipping has made Saham have to plan well ahead. We plan our schedules anywhere from a 12 to 15 month construction schedule. Um, we really have to be careful so we don't get stuck without materials on site. This crisis not only impacts residential developers, but also commercial. It's very difficult getting material at the same price as it was last year. Owner of HVR Builders Hans Van Rael says a piece of plywood used to be $15. Now it's 54. He says not only has the cost gone up, but to get supply is a nightmare. They told me that they couldn't fill my order till January of 22. Van Rael says they have had to cancel some jobs as a result of the low amount of supply and high prices. He expects prices for real estate to continue to go up exponentially. He says currently it is not a buyer's market. Expect to pay more. They're just, you're going to pay more or you're not going to get anything. Saham tells me that if you see a home you like and the price is right to buy it now while interest rates remain low. Abel Garcia, 13 Action News.